Hello everyone, my name is Rose 16 and welcome to a tier list that I wanted to do. And it's because I've been watching lots of Call of Duty zombie stuff lately on YouTube. And it gave me the idea, let's rate, let's make a tier list of some Call of Duty zombie maps. As you can see, we got them, we have them from World of War, World of, World of, World at War, yeah, World at War with the first zombies. And we have it all the way up to what looks like Black Ops 4. So starting off with Alpha Omega, I've never played it, so I'm going to put that there. I haven't played Ultra Blood. I haven't played Asian Evil. I'm guessing these are all from Black Ops 4 Zombies or Cold War. Are the Black Ops 4 or Cold War? I haven't played either of those except for the aforementioned one on the Titanic. So Ascension. I have played Ascension. I've played the Black Ops 3 version and I loved it. It was awesome. I liked how you could have all the rockets. I liked the Wonder Weapon that was there. And the OG one, there was a uh, PhD Flopper. Although I haven't, I didn't play it on the Black Ops version, so I'm gonna put that. I love it. I'm gonna put in. I'll put in AT. Actually, Ricky, yeah, I'm gonna rate it how I want. Ascension B. I'm putting in B because I haven't really. I didn't play the OG one, but I did love what I saw in Black Ops Three, the ra attack with the radioactive thing. I'm guessing that's uh, Infinite Warfare. That's his on that. I'm guessing, but I haven't played it. Blood of the Dead. Blood of the Dead. Blood of the Dead. Blood of the Dead. That's a Black Ops 4 remake of... What's it called? Mob of the Dead? Is that what it was? Anyway, I played... I haven't played Mob of the Dead. I had... I did, however, see the section of it from Black Ops 3 in Revelations. I haven't played it, so I can't give it an honest... Re Actually, I did play Blood of the Dead. I don't think they're the same thing. Blood of the Dead is quite different, but I did play Blood of the Dead. I remember. It's from Black Ops 4. I liked it. It wasn't great, I don't think. I, to be honest, I didn't play a ton of it, but I liked what I saw, so I'll put it in C, just to put it there. I did not play this one. Buried, I did not play. I have seen gameplay of it, though. I will let gameplay count. I, I frick you, no, I won't, I won't put it there. I never played it. Bus Depot, of course I played it. Uh, for just, is it just Bus Depot or is this including like the whole train? No, it's not. It's just Bus Depot. It's pretty garbage by itself, but it's not. It's, it's pretty. I don't like it. I don't like it. I'll put in D. It doesn't deserve an F, but it's, it's about D. Call of the Dead. I did not play it. Carrier. Did not play it. Classified. Of course I played it. Easy A tier. I love that map. It's it's supposed to be one of the harder maps from Black Ops 1, but I love it. I love how it is. It's kind of a nostalgia factor, but I did love playing it. Dead of the Night. Uh, I don't recall playing this. I don't remember playing that. Der Eisendrac. I remember playing this. I liked it. The arrows, the bows, the elemental bows, whatever they were. Those are cool. I'm going to put in B. I'm going to put in B. Descent. I'm guessing this is a. Uh, from the looks of it, this looks like a advanced warfare. Zombies, I didn't play that. Die Rise, I did not play that either. Farm, I loved Farm. It's small, but it's simple. It has the perks, it has the box, and Farm is. I remember when I. Like, I didn't get into the zombies thing until like uh, 2015. I didn't play Call of Duty or anything until like 2015 or 2016. So I didn't experience the Black Ops 2 or Black Ops 1 era. I only experienced really the Black Ops 3 era. But I, when I did finally get my hands on Farm, I loved it. And I remember watching this game. I remember watching people play it on YouTube. Just, I'm just going on a rant, sorry. But I remember people playing on YouTube and it was so, bro, it was kind of nostalgia. Wait, hold up. Classified isn't five? I don't know how I got those two mixed up. Grod Krovi, A tier. Actually, see, I wasn't a big fan of Grod Krovi because of how much little space there is to move around, and I was just kind of bad at the map. But actually, you know what? I'm going to put uh, I'm putting an A tier. I will put 5 and S tier. I love this map. I love it so much. This is a Black Ops 4 map, I'm assuming. I have not played it. Infection, that's from... 
Advanced Warfare. This is Black Ops 4. Kino Order Toon is an S tier. Mob of the Dead, I haven't played. I am really seeing how many I have not played. Moon is an obvious A tier. Nocturne Toon, simple map. It's very nostalgic, but I loved it. Even though there's like zero perks. Unless you play the Black Ops 3 version, then you got the, you got the, what the heck is it called? You got the random perk giver thing. I have not played Nuketown. I have played Origins. I love Origins. It was so much fun. You got the staffs and like, it's great that, see, usually I don't like preparing, like running around and getting all my equipment and loadout ready, but getting the staffs built together, it was fun. It was great. Outbreak, I do not, I don't think I play that. Raven the Redwoods, I did play this. I do not like it very much. I don't really like any of the Infinite Warfare stuff. And I'm not just saying it because it's uh, Infinite Warfare bad, even though it, it kind of was, I'm gonna be honest. I did not really like Infinite Warfare for the most part. But I'm putting that in C. Blood of the Dead. I haven't played this. Yes, I did. I remember why I put that there. <laughs> I'm kind of stupid. Revelations. I loved Revelations. Shadows of Evil is an obvious A tier. I liked it. The Wonder Weapon was really cool, too. I didn't... Just, you know, I haven't done any of the Easter eggs, okay? I barely got some of the Wonder Weapons in most of these. Like, the ones that you got built, like the buildables and stuff like that. I barely did any of that. Shangri-La, I love the map, even though it's difficult. Shelling Shuffle, this is from Infinite Warfare Zombies. I did not play that. Shino Numa, uh, it's A tier. I wouldn't put an S tier. Uh, I'll put an S tier, actually. Beast from Beyond, I did not play that. The Darkest Show, uh, sure, I didn't play that. Final Reich, I like this one. Uh, actually, I, I like this one quite a bit, the, this one. I really liked it. The Frozen Dawn. I don't remember playing that. Man, there's not a lot that I played. Jeez. The Giant, I loved it. Okay. Shadow Throne, didn't play it. Didn't play it. Town, it was okay, but I didn't actually know. Yeah, I'll put it right here. That was pretty good. Transit, I like Transit, but I feel like they could have done better. And like, oh, check this little PS3. I'll put it in B because I know that there's some potential that they didn't. They should have remastered for Black Ops 3 instead of all the any of the other ones and made it better. Olympus, haven't played it for Rux. That's a B. Voyage of Despair, put it in C. I liked it, but it, eh. Eh. She, Zetsubo no Shima, I, I have not, did I play this one? I don't think I played this one. Zombies in Space and played it. Uh, it was, it was, mm. There weren't really any wonder weapons that were out to use, were there? I think you had to build your own wonder weapons. Just, I think it's an F. If I'm wrong, then, oops. The Giant Durries. I think the Giant, the giant and Durries are the same thing, correct? I think it's just from Black Ops. Not Black Ops, the other one. Oh, freaking. Dagger Tone? I don't remember playing this. Okay, so what have we learned today? That I have so many more zombies maps that I have to play. And I'm really disappointed in myself that I have not played Zetsubo no Shima or Mob of the Dead. Nuketown, I really want to play that. Die Rise, I want to play that so much. Buried, I got to play it, along with Call of the Dead. So there's a lot of them I haven't played, but there's some that I have played. So if I get to playing those, maybe I'll make a new tier list for this. But until then, that's it for this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye. Please don't hate me for this.